All right, so here we are today. I was really excited about getting the shave cloth and it finally got here. Um, I'm hoping that this setup works because I don't really know what I'm doing, but I just kind of got this cheaper shave cloth. This is a 40% um, just because I know the peppers and stuff still like a lot of sun. So we want to make sure they're getting it, but just kind of help with the temperature a little bit. But I got these like little clips that clip on because this is like a cheap one. So I need somewhere to clip stuff and then these little um, ball bungee cords. And you can see I've just kind of done it all along. Um, and then I guess like an issue is that over here we have this fourth one that there's no fence to attach it to so I was just trying to use what I had and I've kind of secured it with this bungee bungee through the whole of this and then this is like a cheap thing from Walmart that like comes apart really easily so I just tied this knot and then I hooked two bungees up there together and then put this hook through it um, oh, maybe I should do a bungee through there. Um, there's not really anywhere else on the house to attach stuff. I don't want to like break the gutter or anything. And so I thought that this spot could be okay because it is attached right here and right down here. So like if there's theoretically like any blowing, you know, it doesn't really move. Um, and then I just kind of did a little like test of just like pulling on it like ooh, it's really windy and uh it's just so thin that i think it'll be okay i don't think it's gonna go anywhere so yeah some of my plants are still kind of in the sun right now it's like 3 45 p.m uh scalding hot day so i do notice when you kind of step under here there's definitely a little bit of a temperature change that feels a little bit better so I'm hoping that this is enough and that this works so um, moved my tomato plant in so he's under it but I'm sure that the reason this isn't fully covered is just because we're starting to get that uh, hot afternoon Sun but it covers them mostly so there's no way they do any worse than they already are um, I've also just kind of strategically, you know, this tomato plant was doing just fine with the heat. So I'm leaving it here on the outside where it's gonna get some of that sun. Um, the strawberries are doing okay. The liver plant does not like the sun at all. You can see the sun scald is kind of crazy on it, but I don't really have anywhere else I can put it. So, um, but our bell peppers are completely covered. Our tomato is covered and our uh, Rico hybrid is covered. So hopefully those will start producing now that we've got that all set up. So just kind of do one more little walk away of this. You can kind of see what that looks like. This is kind of ugly, but it'll be worth it. All right, bye.